Barbary macaques, the only non-human primate found living wild in Europe. Native to Morocco and Algeria, they are the only macaque found outside of Asia. Macaques are very sociable by nature and have been studied intensely, finding that the lifestyle of macaques in Gibraltar and Morocco are very different, with the former being very reliant on humans, mainly tourists. Naturally, Barbary macaques spend a lot of their time grooming and foraging with their troop, which can be made up of as many as 50 individuals with an even split of male and females. Naturally, they will eat grasses, leaves, seeds, plants, insects, berries, bark and mushrooms. However, in Gibraltar, the macaques rely heavily on tourists feeding them and picking leftovers from residents. The macaques you see here are foraging for their own food, but it may surprise you to know that they aren't wild. They are captive here at Blair Drummond Safari Park in Scotland. This trip from Gibraltar arrived in 2014 after being deemed the troublemakers and problem group living wild there. They live in a naturalistic three and a half acre enclosure which gives them ample opportunities to express natural behaviour and live as wild as possible, while still being managed by a team of keepers. The enclosure is a drive-through reserve which has two large ponds, trees, log piles, open grassy areas, overgrown shrubbery and a mixture of landscapes to mimic the terrain of their wild counterparts. The reserve is left to grow wild, which in turn promotes natural behaviours for the macaques, but also encourages the native species to use the reserve. The reserve isn't just a haven for the macaques, it's also a haven for the native species, with multiple birds choosing to nest in the reserve along with bees nesting in some of the dry, rocky hills.
This means that even at night, the reserve is full of life. Inside the house, the macaques are still given the opportunity to express natural behaviour, while still being managed to allow training for health inspection. As far as we know, Blair Drummond is the only zoo in Europe that has carried out and filmed conscious dental checks and nasal swabbing with Barbary macaques. The heated indoor area is equipped with hanging platforms, visual barriers, climbing apparatus, ropes, and the walls are covered in climbing grips. The floor is covered in wood chip to allow foraging for food, which is dispensed from an automatic feeder called a feed pod. This feeder puts out both timed and random feeds and can be controlled from a mobile phone or computer. The feed pod is loaded with a dry scatter mix which the macaques are fed five times a day in the house as well as five times a day out in the reserve. The dry mix is made up of a large variety of pulses and seeds. This is fed alongside fresh vegetables. Here, however, the macaques don't get any fruit. Visitors to the park can observe the macaques playing, foraging and grooming all from the comfort of their cars. Occasionally, the more inquisitive of the troop give the public a real close-up view when they jump onto the cars. We don't encourage this behaviour, but the young ones in particular enjoy playing on them. Some like the extra height to enjoy the view. Here at Blair Drummond, we have continual researches carrying out studies to ensure welfare standards progress and advance. This graph shows how close we are to mimicking the activity budget of the macaques of Morocco. It is incredible to see how far they've come from their old lives in Gibraltar. <laughs>